Hey everyone, Canadian Trucker here. Today we're in the town of Dryden, Ontario. Beautiful sunny day, not too hot, not too cool either. Um, yeah, it's lunchtime. We got a, what I think is a 2012 LRP, Long Range Patrol. Um, packed by the Warnick Company, so it doesn't have the day code down here. I bought this off eBay a couple years ago. I'm thinking it's 2012. So let's open it up and uh, see what it says. 20104, so 104th day of 2012. Nailed that one. So we got toasted corn kernels, lemon poppy seed pound cake, not trans fat free, oatmeal cookie, chocolate flavored coating. Told you, Corey, that's why I put this in the fridge, just in case this was in here. It's, uh, this one's actually not sealed that great compared to others, so hopefully it's all right, but, uh, yeah, a little bit of air in there. And, of course, we got grape beverage base powder. We got our main beef stew. We got our spoon. We got our accessory pack. Now, I got to open this up because I don't know what kind of coffee that is. Let's see what's inside here. That smells very minty probably because we go we got two toilet papers and a wet nap you get two because these are like 12 hour rations so a sugar non-dairy creamer and diaro coffee i have never seen this coffee before take a look at that got Tabasco sauce, and our salt, and our red tip matches. There's our beef stew made from Oregon freeze-dried, which is now known as Mountain House. There's a tear notch here. Don't use that tear notch. Get yourself a knife. It's got very little smell. Looks like that. You gotta kinda bust it up a little though. And for those of you who's, yeah, for those of you, fuck me. And for those of you who care, it's got 580 calories, 19 grams of fat, 2440 milligrams of sodium, which is only 102%. It's got some other stuff, fiber, sugar, etc. protein, 43 grams. So that's all right. At 16 ounces of hot water. And 16 ounces just happens to be how much water I boiled. Get her in there. Okay, now we got to stir this up a little bit. Put our clip on there, and we're going to let this sit for, oh, says 10 minutes. We'll probably let it sit a little longer. So I find it odd they put toasted corn kernels in this. Um, LRPs have a 10 year inspection date. So a 2012 technically is good till 2022, which is where we're at right now. Toasted corn kernels have a half life of about three months before they taste like oily and horrible. So let's, uh, let's see how they did. Yeah, they stink like oil. Not much different, I guess, from when they're fresh. I, I find these are kind of a useless thing. The barbecue ones are all right, but they definitely aren't corn nuts. They're corn kernels. Take it back. These are actually pretty fresh tasting. So our lemon poppy seed pound cake, 300 calories. And this must, well, let's take a look. Trans fat, 14 grams. So you know it's good. I think these ones are supposed to be better than the trans fat free. I don't think I've ever had one with trans fat. And unfortunately it's damn lemon. Which in the last last one of these I had I actually enjoyed. It was brand new, it was 2022 or 2021. 2021.
smells good as it should don't eat that Um, the only difference, and I, I just had this in the fridge because it was real hot the other day, so I put all the rations I had in my truck in my fridge. Um, but it's a little, um, not sticky, but like real smooth and moist sort of feeling. So I don't know if that's a trans fat thing or what. There's the inside. I'm not sure if the camera's picking it up, but that's a like a lot more yellow like a deeper yellow than uh, than normal maybe it's gonna kill me maybe I'm gonna really enjoy this maybe you guys are never gonna know let's try it and this lemon cakes growing on me um, so yeah it was like two weeks ago I had a 2021 lemon poppy seed pound cake trans fat free this one's 2012 with trans fat honest opinion I can't tell the difference one bit um, I'm not an expert but um, I'd say these are pretty damn close in flavor I would say they're a little more dense and a little more like a brownie texture than a cake um, but yeah that's actually real good Take a grape drink. <clears throat> I'm going to add it to 12 ounces of water. Look at that, it's white. Ish. But it quickly changed to purple. Here it is. Oatmeal cookie. I don't know if those are supposed to hit or not. Still looks good. Little slight bit of bloom. See where the chocolate melted and put little holes in there. It smells perfectly fine. That's fantastic. These are better when they're fresh. Uh, the 98s, I've had a couple of, <clears throat> I've had a couple 98s and uh, they're still good, but you can taste that they're better the fresher they are and these are 10 years old and they're freaking awesome um you can still get these in uh like 2015 2016 mountain house i think it's the beef stew actually uh no, mountain house uh meal cold weathers so you can still get these if you get one give it a try don't trade there's a good healthy purple color for a purple drink taking one for the team here Jim I know you hate this stuff so I'll try it out so you don't have to so this one's not bad this actually tastes like uh, like grape kool-aid um, it's probably fine not my favorite but maybe I'm getting used to it so the only bitch about these cookies is they melt quick, like almost instantly. So as soon as you open it, you gotta eat it. So just added up the calories, <clears throat> 1,470. That's not counting the sugar pack. So you'd be probably just over 1,500 calories for one LRP. Whereas a regular MRE, I think are around 1,200 and around there. I'll never be able to eat this whole thing. So we're gonna eat half, throw half in the fridge. This stuff is actually, any mountain house is probably better the next day warmed up. Oh no. How's that look? So there's what it looks like. You got beef, you got peas, carrots, and potatoes, all in a nice beef gravy pretty simple luckily this one's not all peas the way some of them can get there's probably mostly potatoes um, and then beef and carrots and peas would be about the same try her out so that's absolutely perfect it's amazing how fresh the peas taste 
I don't really like peas. I guess I don't care anymore. When I was a kid, I hated peas. Um, but these taste like you just got them out of the garden. I guess that's the freeze drying. Um, as for everything else, taste the way a beef stew should. That was 15 minutes with the full 16 ounces of water. So that was our 2012 menu number seven beef stew, long range patrol food packet. Awesome. I am glad I got this. It, like I said, I've had this probably even three or four years. Um, if I find another one of these, I will be getting it for sure. Um, everything was good. I was really worried about those corn whatevers, but uh, they tasted perfectly fresh and were quite enjoyable. Old trans fat pound cake. Nothing wrong with that, and that cookie's friggin' amazing. Even our grape drink, I'm not overly disappointed. I probably will drink this. Um, this one tasted fine. It's that blue one that comes in the great big square pack. I hate that friggin' thing. Turns blue, gives me a headache every time. Hate it, but yeah. So that's it for me. Thanks for coming, everybody. So that's it for me. Thanks for coming, everybody. We'll see you next time.